Hi guys, so um, as you can read, it, this is an elf haul. Um, a couple weeks ago, I bought some things from elf.com. They were having a sale. I forget what it was. I think it was after $25, it was free shipping. Or you can get like a bunch of mineral makeup for 50% um, off. Um, but of course I did the free shipping because I like from the regular studio line or and the mineral line and all that so I'm just gonna share with you guys some things that I got so yeah okay so for the lip products I got um, a couple you know a few variety of lip things I got a lipstick in classy and it looks like this it's really pretty um, I really like it it's just the only thing that irritates me about this lipstick is not about the color at all. It's just like when you are using the lipstick, the lipstick moves around a little bit. And I don't know if you can see, but it's like all the way on the edge. It, it like scrapes against this clear plastic part right here and comes off on the edge see right there that product there and that's just like annoying I feel like I'm gonna break the lipstick but it's a really pretty color I like it a lot it smells good too like you know like a fruity scent there'll be um I'll take a picture of the swatches and put it on my blog so you guys can see it a little better I know my MacBook doesn't really do a good job at that Another thing that I got that I've just been loving a lot is the Hyper Shine Lip Gloss. And this is in um, Berry Cherry. This just is really, it looks like this. And um, it's just a really nice gloss. So there's the Berry Cherry right there. And it's just really nice by itself. Or sometimes what I've been doing is I have this lipstick by NYC, I think. Oh, Wet n Wild. 902C. It's just like a nude color. Um, but I'll put this on just to have like a lipstick or whatever. And then I'll put the gloss over it and it's just so nice. I like it a lot. It is sticky though. That's the only thing. It is a sticky gloss. Um, but when you put it on, plus with the lipstick, you put this over it, it lasts a while. Um, but yeah, it is pretty sticky. So, not one of those kissable lipsticks, but um, still a really nice color. Then, I got um, this Luscious Lipstick Oh, Luscious Liquid Lipstick. So, it looks the same almost as the Hyper Lip Gloss, but um, as a different applicator, like this. And you wind, you twist it, and the product comes out of these little things. You probably can't, the product's kind of coming out. And this is a really nice one, too. This is in um, Bark. So there's Bark and Berry Cherry. So yeah, this one's really nice too, and it's it lasts longer than the um, lip gloss, obviously. And it's really nice, really nice um, pigment once you put it on your lips. It lasts a while. They're not as sticky either. Then the last one I got, this is in color... I don't know how to say this. Proline. I don't know. But it's um the matte lip color. This is the first time I've ever tried one of these, but this is what it looks like. And um it like winds up like a pencil. And that's the color there. Right over here. So like I said, again, I'm going to take a picture of these, but you can see, like, 
all the all these other ones have that sheen to it. Even this lipstick has a little sheen to it, but this doesn't. You know, it's really nice, and it would look really nice with either one of these lip glosses over it. You know, so those are my lip products. So for eyeshadow, I didn't get any eyeshadows, but what I did get was the, um, well I didn't get any individual eyeshadows, but I did get a beauty book, the Bright Eye Edition. So it looks like this. They have a, a lot of different ones, ones with more neutral colors, but you guys already know me, I do neutral all the time. I have a bunch of neutral palettes, so I wanted something where I could experiment with different colors, and this was only like $5, so... And I love it. Like, it comes with all these colors here. And the pigment on these is just, like, crazy. You know? Like, e.l.f. is really stepping it up. Because I remember when I first tried um, e.l.f. Cosmetics, it's like, ooh that gold. Look at that gold. It's like e.l.f. was, um, their eyeshadows are really dusty and not as good quality and these are like crazy good quality. This gold, my finger like just sunk into there. It was so soft. And um, same with this blue up here. It just, like look at that blue. It's exactly what it is in the, um, you know, in the pan. It's exactly the same color this purple you know exactly the same color so I really appreciate that I really love I would pay more I would pay more I have a um, Urban Decay palette I pay like 30 something dollars I would pay that for these colors in this quality also it comes with um, just some instructions on how to use some of the shadows if you're not really sure like what to do with these crazy colors um, it just gives you some guidelines there so yeah and it also comes with an eyeliner. I haven't used it though. Brightening eyeliner in black. Just a little, you know, little uh, sample size. And um, an applicator. Double ended. So I just thought that was a really good purchase. Definitely like those colors. And I have been using it. Haven't really used the bright colors yet, of course, because, you know, I just. I'm just so into my neutrals. But, um, yeah, so, <laughs> that's that. And then also I got an eyelid primer. I never really use primers because I don't do stuff long enough to need a primer. But I thought it would be good to have one, so, um, yeah. It, yeah. So I got this one. It was like a dollar or something. I think they have another one, and it's three dollars or something like that and you can just look these up on YouTube there, there's a bunch of reviews on the elf primers a lot of these elf products there's a lot of reviews on them so if you're not sure always do your research and just check it out I did my research on the primers and on these lip um, liquid lip glosses and stuff I did I did my research on all this stuff just make sure you do that because this is online and you're really not sure what you're getting until it gets to you so yeah, <laughs> my little lecture. Okay, all right, and lastly, I just have a concealer palette and some, just two little brushes. So I got this concealer palette in medium, and it looks like this. Complete coverage concealer. And, um, so it comes like this. It comes with a mirror, and, uh, it comes with these different shades and concealer. Now, I've tried all of these shades, but the ones that I use the most are these two at the end here. I use this one for under my eyes, and I use this one over any blemish. This is like the exact same color as my skin, and I use it over uh, any blemishes or anything. These other two I don't really use that much, just because they're not a perfect match for me. These two are just perfect. If this came in a duo or whatever, I would totally get that. But, um, I think this is like 3 or $5 or something like that. But I think this is worth it, especially if you're not sure about concealer. Once again, I think all these e.l.f. products is 
perfect for if you're not really sure about something and you just want to try out a product like an eye primer or a concealer check out elf they have great prices and they're always having some type of sale like when i went free shipping that's a big deal and then sometimes they just have like 50 percent off of everything you know you just really have to check it out all right so for the brushes i got the elf um kabuki face brush this brush is amazing the quality is crazy it's so freaking soft like this feels like a mac brush this feels better than mac like this is just so perfect this is the um this is the only kabuki brush i've ever bought because the other ones were just they just didn't feel like this like i wouldn't spend my money on those this i would have spent i think it was eight dollars i would have spent twenty dollars for this that's how good it twenty five dollars like i would buy this for twenty five dollars and i'm cheap <laughs> so it's a dual fiber brush it's so this soft. this is a really good brush and i use it with my uh... bare minerals foundation this is the only foundation i really use um, so yeah i've been using it with this and it works perfect perfect then the other brush i got a small angled brush just like that and I use this to fill in my brows. It's perfect. And also, I use the e.l.f. eyebrow kit in dark to fill in my eyebrows. And as you can see, I like I use it for real. I don't use the powder though. It's just not not working for me. But this angled brush and this are just perfect together. So yeah, that is all I got for you guys. Um. So I hope this wasn't too boring. <laughs> I'm kind of like a little scatterbrained because um, I just got home from school and like my family's visiting. So I'm trying to do this when they're not here and I don't know when they're coming back. So I'm trying to like <laughs> hurry up and get this video out the way. But I hope this was helpful, especially to some of you guys who are interested in e.l.f. and just really not sure what to even get because they do have a lot of stuff. Um, yeah, try out these, um, definitely these lip things and this concealer and this kabuki brush are things I really do recommend because they're perfect. <laughs> so, yeah, bye guys. <laughs>